In Fort Worth, Texas, a violent explosion at a historic building has injured nearly two dozen people. And firefighters search what's left of the Sandman Signature Hotel after yesterday's blast. We're looking at after uh, results of the explosion. Omar Villafranca has more on what happened and some of the people trapped inside. Holy crap. The blast at the century-old building was powerful enough to rip large chunks off the facade and send debris hurling into downtown Fort Worth streets. Around 3.30 p.m. on Monday, the suspected gas explosion rocked the Sandman Signature Hotel, blowing out at least the first two floors. Something just blew up outside my office. Oh, my God. 21 people sustained non-life-threatening injuries. Fire officials described a chaotic scene with some of the injured even treated on street corners. We did extract several people from the basement that weren't able to get out on their own. 26 rooms were occupied in the 20-story building, and crews had to put out a fire inside. I really thought it was a bomb, and then I started smelling the gas. Officials are looking into exactly what caused the explosion. The hotel said in a statement that it's working with first responders and will help those injured. For CBS Mornings, I'm Omar Villafranca, Fort Worth, Texas.